Hi guys, NeverKill2K12 here, and I'm here with another Rome Total War online commentary. I am playing as Skiffia, and my ally is playing as Freyze, and we against and we are against Gaul and Germania. This was a barbarian only battle, and I hosted this. Uh, I have to apologise for not getting any videos up anytime soon as today. Um, you may have noticed. I'm talking a little less louder than I normally do, just because it is 11:30. I do not want to wake anybody up. Well, let's have take let's take a look at my army, shall we? I have four silver, silver axemen, and these guys really do suck. <laughs> I mean, Skiffy's melee units do suck. They look pretty cool though. I'll give them that. Then I have two archer warband. Which have, yep, all my archers have gold attack. And I have two chosen archer warband. And I have six headhunting maidens, all gold gold. Then I have, I think it's four overall. Yep, I have four horse archers, skiffing horse archers, with gold attack. I don't see the point in getting the noble horse archers as they're just more expensive and they are not very good in combat then I have one I think over there oh no I have oh yeah and uh, then I have one barbarian cavalry bronze bronze my ally you lost the game his army composes of let's have a look here three phalanx pikemen two upgrades on, all of them. And he has three units of Bastani. All and they all have two up upgrades on, I believe. Nope. They'll have four upgrades on. There we go. Then he has three units of Phalax men. And they all have multiple upgrades on as you can see there. Then he has how many archers? And he has two archer units with no upgrades on. And he has one general armoured bodyguard with five upgrades on. And then two Greek cavalry with multiple upgrades on them both. Let's take a look at our opponent's army, shall we? The Germania player, Chi, I believe that is pronounced has one, two, three, four, five, six chosen archer warbands and I think they all have gold attack I'm assuming they are very expensive for Germania and he has two units of berserkers and these guys are like tanks so I tried to take them down with my missiles then he has three units of night raiders on this flank no upgrades and then he has chosen axemen, three units of them and then these two units have three upgrades and this unit has one upgrade and he has one gothic cavalry here with no upgrades some barbarian noble cavalry and then he has some more gothic cavalry and then some more gothic cavalry and his cavalry have no upgrades on so as you can see you went for a very minimal upgrade army but with large numbers now this is just a massive chosen swordsman spam and they all have multiple upgrades on as you can see apart from these here <laughs> I don't see why he did that I would have just scrapped these two units and put upgrades on this one and then he has some barbarian noble cavalry and his, that's where his general is and he has plenty of upgrades on there Let's get on with the battle. Skip to the action, shall we? So, at first I thought they were going to double team me, so we both move up so I don't get absolutely slaughtered. <coughs> these guys, these headhunting maidens, these are amazing. They're armor piercing. Now, I'm not going to do very well in this game because having a large cavalry force means a lot of micromanagement. And as you guys have seen in some of my previous battles, I suck at micromanagement. <laughs> so 
So as you can see, he's going to send a chosen swordsman to attack my axemen. So I'm just going to charge him with two units. As you can see, my archers are firing. I'm not sure at what unit though. Maybe the fire. I think we might be firing it over here. So here I just complete this around these chosen swordsmen. You can see I'm getting pelted by arrows. And the, there we go, he routes. As you can see, my lay is engaged with Gaul. And I, I help him out and I get a nice rear charge on these chosen swordsmen. I get another nice rear charge. I really did not use my horse heart just to my advantage in this battle. I'm going to sit over here for most of it just because my micro absolutely sucked in this game. So this is where he brings up his gothic cavalry. And his noble cavalry as well I believe. And I wasn't looking so he has a nice charge on my barbarian cavalry but I didn't really care because these are quite crappy units anyway. Some nice shots off on his cavalry. My ally moves some phalanx men to help me, but his cavalry got away. And as you can see, these chosen swordsmen are surrounded. My ally is doing very well to fend them off. I don't think I actually covered the goal player's name. <laughs> so his name is Sweeten. I believe I have fought him before. I'm not sure if I've put the video up. But if I haven't, then I will find it. And I will put it up. Now here we go. This is his berserkers and they're going in berserk mode. And they're going to kick some ass. The enemy warlord shows his worth. Watch this. Nothing. Any Ooh. You have killed the enemy Damn. general. Now his men show fear. Now they may turn and run. Attack! Attack! Okay. Now seeing that these he's got his these berserkers, they're gonna retreat and just try and fire as many arrows off at them as possible. My ally helps me out by engaging them. I'm gonna kick some ass now. Watch, watch these berserkers. These guys are mental. You see all those arrows flying. I'm continuously firing arrows at these berserkers. Just try and kill them off. The enemy army runs! Now hunt them there down! There we go, my ally managed to defeat Gaul. So now Gaul's army is in full flight. So now it's just me and my ally against the Germania player. So as you can see, I start to surround his army, but he sees this. So he's going to go in for a nice charge. As you can see, that my units are starting to rout. Here we go when he gets this charge. There's going to be an absolute mass route. Which really did suck. I was really disheartened. You can see this berserk here. So you can see a lot of my units route in that combat. But I did destroy a lot of his forces. He is still raining down arrows on me, but my ally is quick to hand, and he's going to chase down these archers. Yeah, Germania and Berserkers really do kick ass. They are awesome. As you can see, he's going to get a nice charge here, so I'm just going to surround him, and that routes his units. As you can see my forces are heavily depleted, a lot of them are in route. Some units did come back as you can see over there. So we got these in Country and Circle. And this one berserker is really kicking ass. Oh! And there he dies. I think my artists were all firing at him. <laughs> and there we go. This is a great victory! The cries of dying enemies are sweet music to our warriors! Indeed. So that's when the Germania player admits defeat. game to Sweeten and Chi I believe it's pronounced. Uh, like, comment, rate and subscribe guys for more videos. Thank you for watching. I am again very sorry for not getting this video up earlier. 
my internet was playing up I've had to do school work because I have an assessment on Monday and also I do have a social life so you know I went out but thank you for being so patient guys I love you see you goodbye